Hi, in this video, we are going to see about the user and seller workflow of the PassUp website. So now we are in the home page of the PassUp website. Now I'm pressing the login button to show you the Facebook, Google and Apple login options that we have in our script. To sign up as a new seller, I have to enter the email address, password and full name. Now an email will send to my personal email which I have entered to confirm that I am a proper user. So once my email has been verified only, I can able to sell my listing in the application. Now to sell my car, I'm just clicking the sell your stuff button and select the category as car sale and upload the images of my car. After uploading the images, I have to enter the location where I'm going to sell my car. As I'm selling car, I have to give an additional information like the make, model and how many mileages I have been driven and the condition of the car and as I'm posting a new listing, I have to give the title and catchy description. You can also add the title description in many languages as this is not free, I have to enter the price, enable the buy now option and the shipping price to complete this listing. Once I press the done button, I will be redirected to the features page to make my listing as a featured one. We do have three different kinds of featured option on a time basis. This can be manageable by the admin. I am selecting basic package and for the payment we have PayPal and Stripe. Now the listing has been successfully placed. Now we are yet to create a new user pressing the sign up button now I have to enter my email password and my full name and after that the same process of the seller will be also followed for the user I have to confirm my email address now in the home page you can see the listing is featured and I can chat with the seller regarding the product so I'm entering that is it still available we have the pop-up chat option in our script so uh, in the same screen itself we can chat to more than two or three sellers in the same time once i share the message to the seller the seller will get notified about the user's message and also the user related information with the profile to enable the chat i can go to the listing once again and just press the chat option as a seller of the particular listing, I can mark this listing as sold from outside the platform. I have to give rating to the users who have been, who have been I talked earlier. At the same time, the user also can give reviews to the seller from his profile. Now we are going to see about the buy now workflow. So I'll click the buy now option and to buy a particular product, I have to enter my address to receive the product. This is the add address form. I have to my, provide my phone number and save this address. Once the address has been saved, I'll be moved on to the next process which is order summary to confirm the order and shipping price and every total price has to be paid and finally I have to select the payment method once again we have PayPal and Stripe now I'm choosing PayPal as a payment mode the user can able to cancel the order until the seller marked it as shipped. This is the seller page. In the seller sales tab, he can mark the status of the product like marked as processing. This marked as processing stage is considered that they have been packing the particular product and ready to be shipped. After that, the seller can ship the product 
and once he press the mark ship button he has to enter the shipment details which is like this is shipment date which method of shipment he is choosing and the service and the tracking id of the shipment to track the order outside the platform and if any additional informations like the tracking ids and any other information he can provide it in the additional notes in the user side he'll be notified as the shipment is shipped and all the shipment details shared by the seller in the seller application and i'm pressing the marker's claim status to confirm that the shipment is reached to the user location and the user has to press the received button to confirm that he received the shipment once he received the shipment he has to provide the rating to the product and also an experience with the particular seller at the same time the seller can also provide reviews to the users about their conversations once both have been given feedback or review to each other the particular seller can see his payout status in his sales page itself that's all about the workflow of user and seller for booking and listing a particular product in our pass up script thank you have a good day